I play the role of Jason, the sales manager at OEC Computers. The company would like to be proactive regarding developing their pipeline and pushing deals to close at quarter end. An important part is customer retention and nurturing their install base, thus obtaining upsells opportunities. The goal is to increase sales as well as get better visibility over its current sales cycle and its effectiveness. I started the SAP Business One cockpit, my main control center, where I place different KPIs and reports that help me do my job and be proactive about my data. I see that although gross profit for the year is higher than last year, sales revenue for the month is much lower than last month and I'm not close to the target. I think there is a problem since the opportunity win rate from the beginning is low. This confirms my suspicion that there is a problem in closing deals and taking full advantage of potential leads. I want to get into more details. Using this count object, I see that I have 18 opportunities in the quotation stage, meaning a quotation has been sent to the customer but no response has been received yet. When I open the report, I sort it by descending order, and I see an opportunity that was supposed to be closed in May. Since my CRM system is totally embedded as part of the ERP, I can drill down to learn more. Here I see the, the potential and gross profit amount, in the Stages tab, I can see that many cycles have been spent already and a quotation has been sent by, by one of my salespeople, Sophie. I want Sophie to follow up on this quotation, so I use the Live Collaboration tool, which allows me to instant message Sophie, asking her to look at this quotation. I will also send a link of the quotation itself to Sophie so she gets a dynamic link to the document, saving her time to locate it. Looking at this opportunity, I can drill down to see the customer master data. In the Analytics tab, I can see specific dashboards that are filtered for this customer, such as on-time delivery analysis, revenue and profit analysis. I see is ordering from me a lot in the past couple of years. I want to learn more about this customer, so I open the Customer 360 dashboard. Here, I can see indeed this is a loyal and profitable customer with a churn probability of 0%. I see usually buys uh, printers from me and that his sales amount have gone down compared to last year, but this year isn't over yet. On-time delivery isn't where I want it to be at 90%, but it's improved a lot since last year. I decide to call him and express my appreciation for being a loyal customer and see if there is anything I can help with. For that, I create an activity and set a reminder to follow up with him next month. To boost up sales, the company is running a promotion until the end of the month on printers. I can use a campaign wizard to create marketing campaigns to my customers or vendors, send them a quick email and possibly get some new orders in.
I base my new campaign on a previously created campaign. It's an email campaign for customers. Here I select the target group where the emails will be sent to. I also attach an HTML5 template that will be included in the email sent to the contacts. I can see the contact list I used before. However, I have an external list I acquired with contacts that don't exist in the system yet. I use the option to import external list from a file. In the next step, I choose to send it using the SAP Business One mailer service and create the campaign. I just need to confirm the email addresses and send. I heard back from my customer, MaxiTech. I open the campaign and identify I received a response from the customer. This way, at a later stage, I can analyze the effectiveness of my campaigns. MaxiTech would like to place an order for the printer. So I use the same window to create this order. I click to create a new order and select the printer he's interested in. Using the recommendations, I can recommend MaxiTech additional items based on past purchases, as well as uh, purchases of other customers that bought this printer. Using the power of prediction by SAP Business One HANA Engine, I can increase the sales as well as customer satisfaction. To summarize, I use different key performance indicators to inform me of my status in terms of revenue and gross profit. I use the report to show me pending opportunities and act by contacting the customer and by pushing that deal to close, as well as maintain customer satisfaction. I increase sales by managing marketing campaigns and recommend to my customer potential items he would need.